The National Assembly Departmental Committee on Agriculture and Livestock has today discovered about 107 bags of suspected counterfeit fertilizer in Homer Bay County. This comes in the wake of mounting pressure for Agriculture CS Mythical Interior to the CAT office over the same. Nelson Mureza with more. For the second day now, the National Assembly Departmental Committee on Agriculture and Livestock toward NSPB stores in areas said to have been mostly affected by the distribution of fertilizer that is said to have been fair. We have noted 107 bags of the GPC and the GPC is part of the fertilizer under question. So they have been put aside not to be sold to the public. Their probe took them to four counties, including Homer Bay, where they discovered 107 bags of GPC fertilizer, which are believed to be fake. Speaking at NCPB depot in Homer Bay town, Nyando, member of parliament, Jared Okello, who is the chair of the committee, said the findings was a result of farmers' complaint, which raised concern over the authenticity of the distributed fertilizer. We have also noted, actually, that a farmer came here and uh, registered his complaint on the same uh, as in line with the policy directive now that farmer ought to have been compensated his six bags. Okelo's statement was backed up by Mumia's member of parliament, Honorable Peter Salasia, who expressed their surprise with the agriculture CS in Kalenturi for lacking information on the ongoing fake fertilizer distribution in the country. When you call upon the CS of agriculture by Linturi to come to tell us what he understands with the issue of the fake fertilizer. It came to our notice that he surprised us that he doesn't even have any information. However, Homer Bay Governor Gladys Wanga appealed to the committee to practice fairness and equity since the fertilizer which was distributed to our county is 130 million Kenya shillings less than the stipulated allocation. The Additional Allocations Act states that Homer Bay is supposed to receive fertilizer worth 165 million. By our calculation, the fertilizer that has been received in Homer Bay does not reach 30 million, which means that 130 million worth of fertilizer has not been brought to Homer Bay. This comes few days when pressure is still mounting on the agriculture CS to vacate his office over the fake fertilizer scandal. Lenturi will now know his fate after the committee concludes their probe into the supply of alleged fake fertilizer at the National Cereals and Produce Board stores. This comes a day after 110 members of parliament led by Bumula legislature Jack Wamboka appended signatures are seeking to remove Lenturi from office. Nelson Mwareza, TV. 47.